Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Nick. Let's continue our journeys. Recipe of Love Season 16 Episode 1 Welcome to Hollywood. I'm going to miss you, hon. Hollywood awaits. I can hardly believe it. This is like a dream. Too bad I can't come with you. I'll be away for just a few days and time flies. I'm worried that it's about to start raining. That's okay. Airports don't stop at, at a little drizzle. Call me as soon as you get there, please. I will. You seem strange. Is anything wrong? I have a bad feeling about this trip. Should I tell him? Yeah, of course. Yes, I'll be honest about that bad feeling. I'm sorry, but I have a bad feeling about this trip. Like a knot in my chest. A feeling of anguish. Sweetheart, there's nothing to worry about. That's because we haven't been apart in a long time. Just take a good care of yourself, okay? Of course, let's go down. My taxi is here. I just hope this is not a mistake. I love you. I love you too, beautiful. I love you both. Scarlet, what are you doing here? I heard Adam is leaving for LA and I wanted to wish him a luck. Luck for what? As a fan of his book, I wanted to pass on some good vibes for the movie to him. And remind you that if you need a protagonist for it, I'm right here. Promotion. Huh. Oh yes, of course, I'm gonna support you as Paula. I think Scarlett would be great to interpret Paula, right? No doubt, but that won't be up to me. I'm just going there to sign an adaptation contract. Well, you could still suggest a few names. We'll see right now. I have a plane to catch girls. We won't bother you anymore, hon. Have a nice trip. Adam, right? That's me, and you are... Frank, Lexi McDowell's assistant. She's the producer. She's waiting for you in her office. Nice to meet you, let's go then. Let me warn you that Lexi is obsessive about her work, a natural reader. And she's in love with your novel. This movie will be a huge success, hopefully. I'm glad to hear you have a good expectations for it. My battery ran out and I need to call my girlfriend. You'll have the time for that later. Lexi wants to see you right now. And believe me, you don't want to make her wait. Why is that? Why is Adam not calling? I still have that bad gut feeling. I need some distraction. Uh, should I go to Mary's or to the food truck? Yeah, I'm gonna go to the food truck. It's more fun and productive. I'll go see the kids in case they need anything. How is everything going, guys? We've been working non-stop, but we're so happy. We're so happy about the food truck. It looks just like the first one. Have you heard from Adam yet? I can't believe he's in Hollywood, surrounded by stars. Since when are you interested in celebrities? I was just saying... Are you okay, Katie? Yeah, sure. I'll go inside to say hi to whoever inside. Yeah, this couple. Katie! We didn't hear you come in. Don't be ashamed. We used a few moments we have to be alone, which are not many. Luca is always prowling. Be patient with him. Fathers are always jealous. 
I guess why don't you come to have dinner with us and dad tonight? That way, you won't feel lonely without Adam. That's a good idea, and I have no other plans. Thanks for the invite. We'll see you then. And the phone is still not ringing. Where is Adam? Lexi, this is him. The great Adam Nolan, the man of the hour. The most sold and coveted of all. Some presentation that is, thanks. Sorry for bothering you, but do you have a charger? I haven't unpacked yet. Frank, charge Adam's phone for him, please. I'll plug it in. Uh, it'll be fully charged by the time you finish. Would you like something to eat or drink? We have a full-time gathering service for our stars. Star? I don't know if that applies to me. I got tangled in your hair like a boy playing in the long grass. Only a star could write such a sentence. Wow, you know that by heart. I know several fragments by heart. First your fan, then your producer. Come on, let's look over the contract. She seems fishy. Gio invited me to have dinner at her house with Luca and Archie. I accept it because I don't want to eat alone. Anton and I have tickets to go see a movie. Otherwise, I would have invited you. No problem. You seem worried. Yeah, about Adam. Adam should have arrived in LA three hours ago. And he still hasn't called me. Maybe the flight got delayed? Why don't you call him? It makes no sense for you to worry like this. That's true. I don't want to be controlling. I just want to know he's alright. I got the answering machine. Now I'm really worried. Well, you've just signed a contract in Hollywood. How does that feel? It's like being in a movie. Good, the next step is to start thinking about the cast. We already have Zack Fit confirmed to interpret Fred. Zack Fit? Really? He's a close friend of mine and he loved the novel. I think he'll be able to interpret Fred's contained desire and mysterious character. Nobody ever described that character so well before. I'm very perceptive. Do you know if my phone is charging? Right, time flew by, didn't it? Frank, bring Adam's phone, please. Here you go. Honey, I haven't heard from you. Can you call me? I'm worried. As I was saying, we need to start to define. Is there a problem? Yes, you shot it. My girlfriend, she left me a message. I should call her. Go ahead if you have to. Yes, I have to. Right away. Yes, I need a moment to speak to her. I'll leave you alone then. We'll continue afterwards. Honey! Adam, I was so worried. I know, I'm sorry. It's all been madness since I got here. And my cell battery ran out. I'm just happy to hear your voice right now. I don't care about anything else. I don't have that but bad gut feeling anymore. Confirm then, you were just starting to miss me. It's not even days yet. Of course, and I won't stop missing you for a second. How is everything going over there? It's all so surreal. I thought it was going to be a simple movie. But it's a huge production. Zack Fit will be the male protagonist. Really incredible. I can't wait to hug you and celebrate this with you. Me neither, but I have to go now. I have many meetings to attend. Yes, and I have to go to Ilpokakio. 
Go invited. Gio invited me to have dinner with Archie and Luca. I'm glad you have fun planned for tonight. I love you, beautiful. I love you, Adam. Talk to you later. Thanks for coming. My dad hasn't left us alone for a second. At least there's someone else for him to look at. Katie, welcome. The table is ready. We only have to bring the drinks. Archie and I will go get them. I'll go with you. No, no. Wait, Luca. I want to talk to you. Go on, kids. And... Yeah, I'm gonna say it. Not understanding, but firm. Leave those kids alone. You can't be looking over their every move. You shouldn't treat Gio like a child. She's not anymore. But she's... She has her own life. Stop acting like her bodyguard. Yes, I think I'm crossing a limit there. It's hard for me to let her go. Thanks for making me notice that. You can always count on me being honest with you. Yes, I know how straightforward you can be. And this is your room. What do you think? It's gorgeous. Thanks for all the special attention. It's only what my star of the moment deserves. Now get ready. I'll be sending a car for you in two hours. Where are we going? To the inauguration party for this project. We the whole team. Sounds like fun. I'll introduce you to the sponsors and company executives. By the way, I have one more proposal for you. I'm listening. We've been talking and we agreed that you should write the script yourself. Me? But I'm not a script writer. That's technical. It can be fixed. We want you to participate in the whole process. Sounds challenging. Only you can add that personal stamp to the plot. But to do that, you'll have to stay here longer. Two months at least. Months? I just think about it. You can give me your answer later. Know that this is a unique opportunity though. Now enjoy. I'll be a script writer? Is this more than a dream? Han, I have news for you. I'm so glad to hear your voice again. Tell me everything. They propose that I stay and write the script for my own film. That's incredible. Congratulations. I'm sure you'll do an excellent job. I hope I do. The only problem is that I'd have to stay here for two more months. What? And did he accept? He will, I'm sure. I won't let him escape. I really like that man and he will soon be all mine. Yeah, distance is not good. Thank you everyone for watching. Have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you guys on our next journeys.